hopefully that was one of those weekends we'll look back on in two months and we, no one will even remember it. We'll think of it as a good turning stick and not not measure us as how our season went. We just got to get back to you know what we were doing at the beginning of the season, playing over hockey, and you know just realize that um, you know we're a family out here. I think we kind of lost that that sense of uh, togetherness. We got to get more fire going. You know we got to get that excitement going on the bench. We got to be more. On communicating and stuff like that. We got, I mean, we got the skill. We got some great players, and you know, right now it's just, it's just not clicking. Yet. I mean, we want to go through the process to become a better team during the course of the season. Uh, we're not the team we hope to be, um, but you know what? That's okay at this time of year. Uh, we're in November right now. Everyone's pressing the panic button, but it's only November. We got a long, long, long way to go. I'd rather be having this now than having this in two months and start getting catching our stride now as opposed to freaking out and. Early March. We had some a couple of real good days of practice. I mean, that, and that's where it all begins. The foundation of any weekend is Monday through Thursday. And when the foundation is there, when the kids work and you have a good week of practice as coach, you, you certainly feel better going into the weekend. You know, it's always fun to play Boston. Um, you know, they're they're a pretty big powerhouse throughout college hockey, and um, I like to think we consider ourselves the same thing. So it's always good when we match up against them too. So. Um, it'll be a fun game. It'll be a good test on the road. They're big, they're strong, and they got a couple good skaters that can uh, really get up in the play. So that makes it tough when uh, when you're forechecking and they get the puck out. You got to really back check because otherwise they'll beat you up the ice and they'll have fourth and fifth guy coming. They've got a great program. Um, they went through their little doldrums. They lost four in a row, and all of a sudden they've lost one three in a row again. Um, they've got a dynamic defensive core. They're going to get up into play. We have to be aware of that. Um, obviously some real high-end offensive players, a goaltender probably be in the World Juniors uh, this year for, for Team USA, so it will be a good catch, test. Uh, obviously we have great respect for their program. When it comes down to it, it's about us. Um, you know, we know our skill, we know our limitations on this team, and that's what we got to figure out. We got we to gotta get back to playing together as a team, and uh, you know, if, when that comes together, I think you know, we'll, uh, we'll match up against Boston pretty well.